What happened to Tiffany Franco and Ronald Smith after 90 Day Fiance? The Other Way Season 1 90 Day Fiance The Other Way couple Tiffany Franco and Ronald Smith got married in Season 1, but a lot has happened since then to update fans on. Maryland native Tiffany and her South African beau Ronald faced the challenges of long-distance marriage and co-parenting in 90 Day Fiance. The Other Way Season 1 then 28-year-old Tiffany met then 30-year-old Smith when she was on vacation in Ronald's native South Africa. After a whirlwind engagement, Tiffany and Ronald married in South Africa. However, their relationship was strained due to Ronald's gambling addiction. As featured on The Other Way in 2018, Tiffany and her then 10-year-old son Daniel, from a previous relationship, moved to South Africa due to Ronald's visa difficulties, but Tiffany ultimately decided to move back to the United States due to safety concerns. The couple welcomed their daughter Carly Rose in July 2019. Unfortunately, Ronald was unable to be present for his daughter's birth, which took place in the United States. He also missed Carly's first birthday. Since their original run in the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, much has gone between Tiffany and Ronald. In the 90 Day Fiance, the other way tell all special for their season, Tiffany and Ronald announced that they were officially beginning the visa process to bring Ronald to the States. But in January 2020, Tiffany took to Instagram to announce that she and her husband were separating. Some things are just irreparable, she wrote. Ronald also confirmed the split on his own Instagram account accusing Tiffany of refusing to register their marriage in the United States. He also alluded to potential infidelity on her part. He then apologized to Tiffany for the accusations and told fans to refrain from attacking his estranged wife. I apologized to her for making her look like the bad guy. I took her for granted so please don't give her trouble. Fortunately, the couple reconciled only a few months later. Tiffany addressed the controversy via Instagram. I'm sorry everything was so public when things got really bad. We both regret doing that and feel quite embarrassed. We both hope to fight for our marriage and spend the rest of our lives together. Tiffany shared a sweet photo on her Instagram to commemorate the couple's anniversary. The coronavirus pandemic has further complicated life for the couple, who still live in different countries. Ronald shared a video of his children to his Instagram account, expressing his frustration at being separated from them. 90 Day Fiance franchise couple Tiffany and Ronald went on to appear in Happily Ever After, season 6 in 2021. During the season, Tiffany got approval from her dad to add him as Ronald's sponsor for the spousal visa, since she didn't make enough money. However, Tiffany was constantly disappointed by Ronald, and his bleak financial situation throughout the season, and viewers watched the pair fight a lot. The couple were not on good terms by the end of the season, and they subsequently broke up and Tiffany appeared on 90 Day, the single life season 3, where she got back into the dating scene. However, it wasn't long before Tiffany and Ronald reconciled again, and Tiffany flew with their daughter Carly to South Africa. However, Things went bad once again, and at the season 3 tell-all, Tiffany accused Ronald of having a girlfriend on the side while she was visiting him. Tiffany and Ronald ended things once again that season. After separating, both Tiffany and Ronald went on a smear campaign against one another on Instagram. They continue to throw jabs at each other and air their dirty laundry online. Tiffany has since had a glow-up after ending things with Ronald and dropped significant weight. Tiffany also showcased a new relationship in 2023. Ronald has been with his girlfriend Lauren for several years now and alleges that Tiffany withholds the kids from him. Tiffany and Ronald were a disastrous 90-day fiancé couple who still have to be in each other's lives as co-parents. Their future in the franchise remains unknown.